I'm impressed. Hello friends, my name is Brandon Dayton. I'm your humble narrator and welcome back to our Pokemon Fire Red Nuzlocke. Albino, Albino <laughs> is uh, up to level 40 now. I'm gonna find a little item that he can hold. That'd be nice for him. A little Dragon Fang, because he's got Twister as well as out uh, Dragon Rage. Medusa, I don't know. I'll give thought on what to hold. And uh, let's go check out the gym. See how bad it is in here. Oh no, the door is locked. Well, that's most unfortunate. Cinnabar Jim's Blaine's quite the odd fellow. He lived on the island since way before the lab was built. The fiery town of Burning Tazaya. Well, I guess we're gonna go in Pokemon Mansion and look around. Looks really desiccated and horrible in here. What happened? My god. <laughs> uh, we get to catch a Pokemon for Pokemon Mansion. A Nidoran female. Uh, I will take it. I'm not quite sure why, but uh, I want. I want! Come with us! You'll be our best friend forever, Nidoqueen. Queen! You probably won't make it that far, Nidoqueen. Queen! Unless everybody dies, which I don't think will happen. Cause we're doing pretty good. So don't set this packing. Yeah, I did it! I can rap, freestyle rap to a really, really, really slow beat. <laughs> it just takes me a second. Don't kill it! Whoop! We killed it. <laughs> Damn. Albie's uh, got got some punch. Packs a big old punch. I'm gonna go ahead and spray some repel so we can figure this out with it. Figure this uh, puzzle out without further interruption. And that'll give us 700 steps in which to uh, remember what I'm supposed to be doing here. Hey you. What are you doing in here? I can't get out. This old place is one big puzzle. I don't even remember this place, to be completely honest. Burglar Arnie sent out Chansey! Oh, we love you, Chansey. Except when you're on the enemy team. Now I have to kill you, Chansey. Slam! Oh, oh, she got slammed so hard, bro. Bro, oh, no. Wow. Threw that fucking Chansey out the window. Well, your Chansey's free, Burglar Arnie. You don't have to worry. He's got a Dew Skull. I'm not really scared because while it has great defenses, its HP total is low. So Dragon Rage should be able to fuck it up relatively well. Yeah. That'll do. And he pokes himself in the eye. Ah! For a curse. And he's gonna die. And it's his last Pokemon. Confirmed. So, yeah, probably not the best, the best move. But it was too late. Maybe he thought he was gonna move faster. Wouldn't have mattered anyways. Curse isn't that good for ghost types. But I do wish it worked the same as it did for normal types. What's this? A thing I can't go through? Wonderful. What's this? Iron. Well, what good is iron? I think it adds some EVs. Um, but we're not really concentrating on that. Repel's effect wore off. Oh yeah, we gotta stop bumbling. I wish I remembered how to how to do this properly. Couple eh? July 5th, Guyana, South America. A new Pokemon was discovered in the jungle. They know where South America is in this universe? What the fuck? Shoal salt. Interesting. I have a bunch of shoal shoal shells. <laughs> and now I have some shoal salt. Hmm. I can't quite properly remember what to do in here. I'll figure it out. Fight scientist. Do I push a button on the statue? A secret switch. Press it. Yeah, who wouldn't? And then, is this open now? Can I come down here? Sort of, almost, not really. Oh, it's all a big circle. I don't know what's happening anymore. Come here, Repel. I need more! Should have bought some Super Repels. But that wasn't available when we purchased these. Oh, this is interesting. Well, I'm gonna go uh, upstairs, I guess. Did the switch affect things? It changed the whole staircase? What's happening? I found a white herb. 
wonderful. My favorite kind of herb. Um... Oh, I thought he wasn't gonna battle me. He, he looked right at me and was like, oh, hey, bro. And then I walked over and was like, what's going on, man? And he's like, I got an Alakazam. You're fucked. Uh-oh. Well, I've got a Dragonite. So we'll see. We'll see. If I Thunder Wave it, it will cripple it severely because Alakazam is really, really frail. Although it hits like a truck, obviously. I, I got a couple levels on him, but he's able to... Oh. Oh. Synchronize. Oh. Well, let's switch into Acorn. Should be able to finish it with the Fake Out Faint Attack. And uh, I don't really want to put Albi in danger. Or Albi no. So, Fake Out for Alakazam. Bam! And it doesn't quite do enough, but I think Fake Out is going to bag it because it's super effective. So, yeah. Kind of a scary poke, but... We, we had we had to switch the baby out of there, but we were able to overcome. Yes. No worries. Burglar Simon, you're a dick. <laughs> you just uh, take advantage of my my nature. Propels effect wore off. Mew gave birth. We named the newborn Mewtwo. Oh my goodness. Some pokey lore. Well, I don't think this is the way to go. Let's go down some more. Yay, said my girlfriend. <laughs> Just kidding, no girlfriend. It it ended. Sadly enough. Dude, what what am I even can I up here maybe? O obtain the pores in barb. Too bad the bag is full. What Thunderstone. Yeah, we could, we got room for a thunderstone. Do I have a weight limit? What the fuck is happening? Why can't I take the poison barb? That's really strange to me. Okay. Whatever. Onwards, upwards. How about over here? Hey, youngster. What are you doing in here? You startled me. I, th I thought you were a ghost. I will be soon. <laughs> Give it a couple decades. Be a ghost. Won't it be wonderful? Oh, where'd you get a Deoxys, bro? He's like the moon. What? That's not even a thing. And he's gonna taunt me. I thought about thunder waving, so uh, fuck, slam missed. Slam always misses. He goes for the superpower. It is not gonna do that much because Dragon Knight has the flying type. So good. That will drop his attack and defense as well, which will make slam a one hit KO, I hope, if it hits. Yes! Body bag! Dango. Even though he's paralyzed, it doesn't really matter. Dragonite's uh, speed stat is a little behind, but it's it's pretty good, all things considered. I've got a big electric uh, weakness, kind of. I will switch into Acorn, actually. I don't want to put Albino albino in any risk, so uh, Cradily or Acorn probably could take out the electrics. But then we've got Crobat and Sea King that are weak to electric, so uh, if we had like one more resistance, then it would be considered a balanced team, or more balanced. Right now, it's it's pretty good, but we could improve it. But we're just rolling with what we got. I think we've been lucky to uh, to have what we do have so far. So, wondrous well. Goodbye, Voltorb. Just the fake out faint attack combo. It'll fuck him up every time. Every time. That Chikorita's not gonna be able to do much to Acorn, the Masta. So we'll get that faint attack going. Knock him right out. Knock him out the box, Luke. Knock him out the box. Oh, and he's got synthesis. Wonderful. Well, I do love that stall tactic. Mm-hmm. I go, I went and got some coffee. I go and get some coffee while I was training my Dragonite. Um, so I should be a little more peppy. These next few episodes. Hooray! In, in, unless somebody dies, and then I'll immediately be fucking devastated, but... There is a switch over here. Press the switch! Who wouldn't? Wonderful. I think something happened. We closed that door. Something happened? Did it open another door? Is there a secret passage? Yay. Boo. God damn it. 
this is trickier than I remember. They're like, put your brain to good use, and I'm like, okay, but I think I gotta go get some more, some more repels first. Then we can brain it out all we like. And I don't understand why I can't pick up that fucking item. <sighs> the music is also, uh, really strange. Repels effect wore off. That's right. That's why we're here. I did use some items for training and did not replenish them, so I will do so now. A few hyper potions. Um, full heals. Yes, yes. I don't know how many I had before. Let's get, uh, this many. That's seven, sir. Yeah, that many! Wonderful. And we can spend like 14,000. That'll work. So we have, uh, 103,102 Poke available to us, which, uh, might be not quite enough. I'm not sure. It's really hard to tell. If we get to the Elite Four and such, I'll heal up as well. Okay, we're healed. Uh, I was gonna say, if we get to the Elite Four, but it should be when we get to the Elite Four. When we get to the Elite Four, we will need lots of full restores. Because it, it, it could be bad. We need to keep people on their feet. If we can keep everybody well healed, then we'll find success. But if people start dropping, it's going to get ugly really quick. Okay. Don't go out the fucking door. Because it's a trap. It's a trap! We'll go down. Like a normal person would. Oh. What's all this? This is different than what I've seen before. I think. What's your name? Uh-oh. Where am I now? Bro. I have no idea. This shit is crazy. Crazy! He's got a mag cargo fire rock. Um, I don't think Batman's gonna do great against that. I'll try biting it. How about maybe a little bit? He flinched. We'll do it again. Flinch him again. Flinch him again and again. Ember comes out, doesn't burn me, which is just fantastic. And I thought Bite was gonna KO. It does not. Here comes the rock throw. Luckily, Crobat avoids because he's so awesome and spry and nimbly nimbly. Nimbly bimbly. So there he goes, level 42. He's getting so big, look at him. So much speed, my god. And uh, he's trying to learn mean look, but I don't really have a need for it. There's no uh, legendary beasts running around in this version, or whatever it is. He's got an Azuril. We'll go ahead and bring in Albino. Try and get him all up to level 42, because it's like a weird thing that I just keep on trying to do, even though it never really pans out. But it's fine, we get close. We get close every time. That's right. Wow, got the Azuril in one hit with a slam. And Burglar Lewis goes down, so give me some of that loot. Yeah, tasty, tasty loot. Hmm. Awesome, super awesome. Who's injured? Just Batman and Albi. Does it work? Yes, it works. It works! I gotta heal up before we go do that. I will probably edit down the uh, secret mansion business because boring. And uh, we'll fight Blaine this episode. We'll, we'll forge on ahead. That's how we're doing these days. It's been taking a bit too long. Longer than I expected to get through this Pokemon Nuzlocke. But I really, really do want to complete it. So a little editing will help me along in that regard. Here we are, Blaine's gym, fuck yeah. Unibrow guy, fuck yeah. High five right here, dude. Right here, dude. Right here, can you see me? Uh, like, through the unibrow? <laughs> JK, JK. Aw, what, what the fuck is this? Pokemon quiz, get it right and the door opens to the next room. Get it wrong and face a trainer. If you wanna conserve your Pokemon for the gym leader, then get it right. Here we go, Caterpie evolves into Metapod. Yes. Yeah, absolutely correct. Go on through! Oh, I like this. Bell's effect wore off. Great. <laughs> um, can we... Oh, we gotta do a thing. 
Pokemon quiz! Get it right, the door opens to the next room. Get it wrong, face the trainer. If you want, conserve your Pokemon for the gym leader to get it right. Uh, there are nine gym badges? No, there are eight. Indeed. Is that scientist just hanging out over there? Because he wants to, uh... Oh, 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 no. I didn't mean to do it again. Oh, shit! Uh, no! It's still no, right? Hasn't been updated in the fucking past five minutes. Good. So I'll conserve all my Pokemon for the gym leader. I know sweet, sweet XP, but, um, I grind. That's how I get my XP. If you want to conserve your Pokemon for the gym leader, get it right! Hollywag evolves three times. No. No Pokemon evolves three times. Twice. Twice is the maximum. Go on through! Thanks, I will. Don't want to fight that guy. Let's just talk to this machine. Face Adrena! Blah, blah, blah! Wow. Are electric moves effective against ground-type Pokemon? No! They are completely ineffective. In fact... And, uh, one more, it seems like. Pokemon quiz! I can't wait to beat Blaine's ass! You'll face the trainer, uh, if you get this wrong, but you probably won't. Pokemon of the same kind and level are not identical. Um, correct. Yeah? IVs? What are you talking about? Whatever, doesn't matter, bye! Oh my god, there's more. Well, Pokemon quiz. Oh yeah, a Pokemon quiz, I get it right, and then the... Uh, TM28 contains Tombstone-y. No. I don't know if it's Tombstone, um, but tombstone is not a move. Blaine's sprite looks so adorable. Ha! I'm Blaine. Whoa. <laughs> the Red Hot Leader of Cinnabon Gym. My fiery Pokemon are all rough and ready with intense heat. Wow. <laughs> they incinerate all challengers. Ha! <laughs> you better have a burn heal. Well, I have full heals. That's even better! He's got four Pokemon. Let's see what he comes out with first. It's a level 42 Spoink. Interesting. Quite interesting. How about we slam it? Magic Coat's not gonna do much. If I was trying to use Thunder Wave or something like that, maybe, maybe, but I'm not scared enough of a Spoink to try and use Thunder Wave on it. That's a sweet 800 XP from a non evolved Pokemon. He's got an Armaldo, so we will bring out Mr. Fuck Yeah, the Super Sea King, and surf that thing into the ground. I assume that Sea King would see fight in this battle. <laughs> see battle uh, in this fight. I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. Yeah, he's out here. It's not against the fire type like we expected, uh, but instead a rock bug. But that's just fine. He's just spamming protect. You only delay the inevitable, sir. You know what comes for you. And that surf is gonna do some great damage, not quite take him out. Um, but he was trying to go for something besides protect. Doesn't matter, he's too slow. I was expecting Blade to use a hyper potion. Um, I don't know why he did not. Fuck yeah, that was a lot of experience. Look at all that attack. Mm-mm-mm. And he's got a Volbeat. We're really uh, doing a number on his Pokemon. Basically because they're not very impressive. The Armaldo is um, extremely strong. If it started taking swings at me, but it did not at all, unfortunately. Uh, so here comes the Volbeat. I will hit it with a Twister. This thing is gonna protect, um, but how long? How long can you keep that up, bro? I don't think for very long. It's all over for you, kid. It's all over for you, kid. It's all gonna be over for you, kid. He protects himself, etc., etc. Here comes the Twister. Finally get it off. And how's it gonna do? Not very well indeed. Double edge. Yeah, that doesn't hit me. Um, let's try a Dragon Rage. We'll see how Dragon Rage does. Do you have a lot of HP or not? A fair amount. A fair, fair amount. Yeah, up at level 40, it's it's kind of uh, losing its usefulness. Oh shit, here comes the Hyper Potion. That's just fine. We will wear this thing down. I have some Hyper Potions as well, but uh, I don't want to use potions during a gym battle. Because I ain't that kind of person. I can just overcome ya. Unless you're Whitney and her mill tank. God damn, that is horrible. <laughs> and Albino levels up. Level 42. Damn, he's so awesome. 
there's a Machoke on the horizon. Batman is the one that I will finish out this fight with. His very last Pokemon. Uh, so Armaldo was really the only Pokemon that I would consider a threatening thing. Machoke could be, um, given another evolution, but unfortunately he's, he's not fully evolved. So, sorry little guy, Wing Attack from Crobat is going to take you out. And we have defeated Lita Blaine! I've burned down to nothing, not even ashes remain. You've earned the Volcano Badge. Heck yeah! Heck yeah! Heightens the special stats of all Pokemon. Wonderful! And I got TM38, which is Fire Blast. Of course, don't waste it on a water Pokemon. <laughs> well, duh. Vulpix or Charmeleon would be ideal for that move. Yeah, but I don't have either one of those Pokemon. I don't really even have a good Fire Pokemon. But it sure is nice to have a Fire Blast TM in the bank. Perhaps I could teach it to Dragonite. Um, but really, I'm hoping to get him an Ice move of some sort. It'll be interesting. I hope you guys will join us for the next episode. Oh, shit. If it isn't Dayton, it's me, Bill. Long time no see. I hope you're still using my PC system. Well, listen, since we met up, how about spending some time with me? There's this little island in the south called One Island. A friend invited me, so I'm on my way out there. How about it? Do you feel like coming with me? Oh, fuck it, yeah. All right, then let's go. On my personal fucking boat. <laughs> my pal's boat. He sent it specially to pick me up. Wow. Bill's got some money, bruh. Wow, that's unexpected. What are we gonna do here? I don't understand. Here we are, this is one island. There are several islands around here, and this is one of them. <laughs> My friend Celio sends the boat to fetch me here. He's in charge of the island's PC network, why it's lonesome. Why am I telling you this now? Just go see Celio. Where, what, what am I doing here? Oh my god! This is all new to me. Hey there, Celio. Bill, can't believe you came out here. Well, absolutely, how's your research coming along? Oh, wait a second. Dayton, this is my buddy Celio. He's one dedicated PC maniac. Celio, this is Dayton, a rising contender as the Pokemon champ. That's really impressive. I hate to say it, but I have zero aptitude for battling. Anyways, I'm glad to meet you. So, bring me up to speed. How's your machine running? It's fi running fine, but we're too remote out here. The PCs on the island just can't link with your PC, Bill. Oh yeah? Let me take a look-see. Hang on here. I think we can make it work. Uh, let me help you, okay? Dayton, can I get you to wait for me just a bit? Actually, can I get you to do me a favor? The island next to this one's called Two Island. There's a guy there that runs a game corner. He has this thing for rare rocks and gems. We keep in touch being fellow maniacs, so I can get you to deliver this meat. Can I get you to deliver this meteorite to him? I didn't say yes. Meteorite in the key items pocket. If you're going to Two Island, please take this. Oh my god, I didn't say I'd go. <laughs> I got the tri pass. It's a pass for the ferry service. All right. Islands 1, 2, and 3. Wow. This actually is something that I don't remember uh, from Fire... from the original Red version. So that's that's pretty cool. I'm impressed that they added uh, more islands and whatnot. Let's heal up. So friends, it looks like we're gonna take a brief detour to at least one, two, maybe even three islands. I hope you guys will join me for uh, this unknown adventure unknown part of the adventure that's really really interesting and uh i think that's a new route that we could catch a pokemon on even mm. so please join us for the next time friends i've been brandon dayton your humble narrator don't forget to like comment and or subscribe if you did enjoy and until then friends bye bye one two three four goodbye goodbye see you again Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.